Hi, in this video I will show you how to import CSV file to SQLite or convert CSV file uh, to a new SQLite database. Uh, this is my website, I will leave link in the description and I created an app that can do uh, CSV to SQLite conversion or uh, import CSV data into the SQLite database. Um, now, uh, to download the app, I'll double click the download button to start the loading process. Now I click on downloaded archive, double click on MSI, and click on more info. Now I'm getting this screen because I'm not registered with publisher. You can see publisher now. So I'll click run anyway to start the installation. Click on next, next install. And click on yes, click on finish. You can see app has been installed on my computer and I have a shortcut on my desktop. Now I can go to this and run this. Um, now I can show you CSV file I have uh, for um, conversion. It's called state CSV. Not CSV. Yep, this one. Let's double click on that. And basically, it's a, a CSV file with first row containing uh, column names and then uh, there are 50 states in, in, in this file and I want to convert it into SQLite database um, now to do this I can uh, I will double click to launch my app then click on select input file and select my states Next step. The first row of my file contains so the first row of my file contains column name. I will leave this check. I can create new uh, SQLite or select existing SQLite. Um, I will just leave the new SQLite. Click on next step. And on the third step, I will run to start conversion. It will ask me uh, name of the file. Um, this name is okay, I'll just click save and you can see that states created, 50 rows imported, so it's table states created and 50 rows imported and I'll save into SQLite, let's go and open this file. Yep, this one. So, I created also SQLite Viewer. It's um, kind of like app that shows contents of SQLite database. And there is only one table. I can switch tables if I want. And I can see all the tables here. Now, let's do the same thing, um, but slightly different. Let's clear this, select different file. I have, for example, this bind input CSV and click on next step. And this time, let's create existing and add data to our um, to our database that we already created. Right? We can add, uh, and I I can select like more CSV files, and they all will be transferred into tables into this file. Let's uh, so let's. This time, let's try to select the existing SQLite. Click on Next. Click on Run, and you can see Bank Info created three rows imported and the same file. Um, let's go and see this file. Double click on it, and now we can see it has two tables. First table, Bank Info with all data in it, and second states with all uh, states data. So there are two tables in, in this SQLite. Yeah, basically that's it. Um, if 
please give it a try and let me know if if this app is works for you. Uh, yep, and if in case of any problem, you can type your message here, or you can email me directly, or or can you can leave comments under this video, and also I will leave a link to the app and to viewer in, in the comments under this video. Um, yeah, that's it. Thank you.